Hello, welcome back to Dawn of Men in the sixth episode today. God damn, look at all these dogs we have here. So, in the previous video, uh, we introduced way more people to our society. I think about like three or four. Um, and we also added on an extra hut for further population growth and all that. And uh, in the meantime of all that, our dogs have been uh, really growing in numbers here. So I guess that's all good. It's all fine and dandy. So uh, people have been just kind of screwing around recently. Uh, we only have a 16% work rate, so people have uh, quite a bit of free time. So I decided to introduce a new little work area where people can gather more uh, plants and berries and all that good stuff. It is winter now, as you can see. It is snowing pr quite nicely, and oh, yep, here comes the snow. And the trader is here, so let's say hello to the trader. Hello, trader. Well, the trader, Varmek has nothing that good. Um, he does have bread though, but it's not like bread's a new discovery. I mean, we've been dealing with bread for quite some time now, aka the last video, but we'll, we'll give him a spare outfit and he can give us uh, some logs as well. So, actually, nah. Let's get some tannin too. I still don't know what the fuck that is, but, you know, it's good to have it. Look at all this stuff. It's not even hard surviving winter anymore, it's just like another season at this point. We're about to be hunting a wild donkey, that's a new creature I think. It's like half zebra, half donkey. Interesting. And one of these seasons we'll hunt a woolly mammoth. That'll really show all the other tribes and clans. That's a, quite a daunting task. <laughs> Look at this poor dog. Oh my god, it's gonna get washed down the freezing river. How cold is it right now? It's 28 degrees out, and this dog is crossing a fast-moving river like it's nothing. Oh, yep. And, uh, there it goes. Wow. Time for more technology! Well, all we can decide from is tanning or composite tools. Um... You know, I feel like we just kind of got our, you know, bone tools. We kind of worked pretty hard on that. So I think... I think tanning is the right move for now. I think I think we'll save composite tools for the end there. Well, we have a new little building thing here. We have the tanner, where things can be tanned. We shall have two little tanning stations, one here and one over there. Ah, so I think that tanner thing that I got from the trader is actually pretty important because I think that new item I got requires it. And there's also a new job, as you can see here for collecting this like sappy shit from the trees I assume so I don't know I guess we'll see how that works oh no this tent is falling apart here it needs repairs repairs needed sir also I don't think we're gonna be able to build these tanner stations because we need logs for them and we're still not able to chop down trees because I didn't decide to get the damn composite tools <laughs> all right well we survived the winter so that's nice all done with that. Oh shit. Well, right as another baby was born, as you can see, we now have a fucking cave lion attacking here. So hopefully we can fend ourselves off from him and tell the boys to hunt this bastard down so we can come prepared. Oh no, it's going for the dog! Oh man! Oh well, better that than a human, I guess. Shit. Oh, and this fucker's still on the hunt, too. Yeah, get it! Oh yeah, that fucking cave lion is so dead. Yes, good job, boys. That was an organized effort there. All right, well now that that's over with, we can get composite tools. We're talking flint axes and flint picks and flint spears and all that good shit. Ah. We are entering into the Mesolithic era. Yes, look at them working away, crafting the weapons and tools and items of the future. Look at that. Uh, the very first of its kind. A flint, like, pickaxe, I think. Right? Yeah, I guess that, that, I guess that was a flint pick. So now they're able to pick at things and do cool stuff, I guess. And now they're gonna bring it into their hut and set it down and finders keepers, I guess. Well, I guess we'll leave it there then. That was more uh, accomplishing than I thought. Is accomplishing even a word? I don't know, but it is now because I just made it a word and uh, language is subjective. So, uh, well, there it is. And 
and probably in the next video we'll we might even attempt hunting one of the great woolly mammoth beasts that lie out there in that vast vast forest so that's what we accomplished in this video who knows what will be accomplished in the next <laughs>